Thank you, Lord, that you show us all things, Father. Thank you that you show us things to come. Thank you that you, we have a comforter who lives on the inside of us. In you we live and move and have our being, Lord Jesus. Thank you that you are the light that shines in the darkness and you have shined in our hearts, Lord. Thank you. And because you are shining in our hearts, Father, we know, Lord, that we can walk in the light and we will not stumble. Thank you for the blood that has been shed for us so we can be cleansed from all unrighteousness. Thank you for the blood that gives us victory over Satan. Victory. We can overcome the devil by the blood of the Lamb. In the word of our testimony, Lord, we can overcome. Thank you that you've seated us with you in heavenly places in Christ Jesus. When we were dead, Lord, you made us alive. And you quicken our mortal bodies. So we can walk and serve you in the newness of life, not in the oldness of the letter. Thank you, Heavenly Father, that we don't have to sacrifice by our own doings, but we come, Lord, because of the sacrifice of Jesus that was made for us. Thank you for the blood that gives us boldness, Lord, and access to the Father. Yes, thank, you, Jesus. thank you, Heavenly Father. Oh, we worship you, Father. We bless you. Let's worship the Lord in this place. Father, we bless you. We come before you, Lord, with songs of praise and thanksgiving. Not just a time of worship, Lord, but we live our lives as a life of worship and honor to you, Lord. Thank you that you have risen and given us, seated us with you. If we are risen with Christ, seeking things that are above and not things that are below. We worship you, we worship you, we worship you. We exalt that name. You are counsel and mighty God. You are the Prince of Peace. The bright and morning star. Hallelujah, hallelujah. Oh, we worship you, we worship you. Hallelujah, Lord, we bless you, we magnify you, Lord. You are the Prince of Peace, the bright and morning star. Thank you for shining in our hearts and giving us a hope, Lord. Thank you for giving us an expected end, Father given us a future, Lord Jesus. Thank you for your plans for us, Lord. Plans to prosper us, Lord. Thank you that you've not given us a spirit of fear, but of power and of love and a sound mind. Hallelujah. Let's rejoice in this place. We know that the healer is here. Jehovah Rapha is our healer. We know that the Bible says where two or more are gathered in his name, that he is there in our midst. So we know that God is here with us. And because God is with us, that we do not have to fear any circumstance. The Lord is our light and He is our salvation. And when we proclaim these promises, we know that they are working and they are working life in our bodies and working life in our circumstances and situations. Hallelujah. We're also so glad for all of you joining us online, even as we worship and praise the Lord. You can sing along with the lyrics on the screen and let the Lord minister to you and comfort you and encourage you this day. The Word of God is its alive and it's powerful. It has never lost its power. And we're going to sing the Word of God and we're going to hear the Word. And let's also choose to be doers of that Word. Because that's how we're going to bring fruit in our lives. So we pray you'll be ministered and encouraged today. Hallelujah. Let's rejoice in the Lord. We're going to sing this song, The Names of God. He is Jehovah Sitkinu, the Lord our banner. He is Jehovah Shalom, the Lord our peace. And let's proclaim his names because the name of the Lord is a strong tower. And we who the righteous run to it, we can be saved. Glory to God. Let's praise him and rejoice. Hallelujah.
He's faithful. Thanksgiving is such an important thing. The word says that we even come with our prayers with thanksgiving to God. And you know, when we start beginning to thank the Lord for what he has done, that shows that we are also in faith, believing when we pray that we've already received it. So let, let your prayers be full of thanksgiving to God. Let's say even when you're believing God for something, you say, Lord, I thank you that I already received it. I thank you that you've already given me my healing. 
and whatever you are believing for thanksgiving will take you a long way and you will see the results manifested in your life so let's thank him with this song hallelujah i just want to thank you lord and i just want to praise you lord i just want to thank you thank you for everything you've done for me i just want to thank you lord i just want to praise you lord and i just want to thank you thank you for everything you've done for me I just want to thank you Lord for the gift of love you gave I just want to praise your name you 
I just want to thank you, Lord. I just want to praise you, Lord. I just want to thank you, thank you for everything you've done for me. I just want to thank you, Lord. I just want to praise, oh, praise you, Lord. I just want to thank you, thank you for everything you've done for me. Let's sing that again. I just want to thank you, Lord. I just want to praise you, oh, praise you, Lord. I just want to thank you, thank you for everything you've done for me. Thank you, Lord. Thank you for saving my life. Thank you for picking me out of that miry clay. You brought me out of the darkness into your light. Oh, Father, those times that you've protected us, the times you've protected us, thank you for your angels that have protected us. You've kept us all our lives. Thank you, Lord, that you lifted us out. Thank you, Lord, we thank you. Thank you, Father. Thank you for those times you protected us. Maybe you didn't even know, but the Lord has protected you from something. And you just, you trusted Him. And He has protected you. The Bible says that His angels surround us. That His angels keep us from falling. Sometimes you can't even see, but the Lord is just protecting you. He's keeping your life. That's something that we can be so thankful for. You know, the communion that we take part of every Sunday when we, when we drink His, remember His blood and His body, we're remembering the benefits also that He did through that communion. The blood of Jesus protects us from all evil. Just like we see in the Old Covenant, how when they shed the blood of the Lamb and it was applied on the doorpost, that it protected them from the death angel. Well, the blood of Jesus is a reminder that we are protected from all evil that is in this world. Thank God that He has protected us. Thank you, Father, for your protection. Lord, you've blessed our world. You've blessed us exceeding abundantly beyond all we can ask or think. We proclaim that promise that now God is able to do exceeding abundantly. Let's believe His promises and take hold fast to these promises. The scripture tells us not to let go of faith. It says that when we hold fast to our confession of faith, when you're proclaiming those promises, hold fast to it. Because we know that there is an enemy out there who comes to steal, kill and destroy. But we've got to say, Lord, this word is my treasure. I'm holding fast to that word. If you're facing fear today, we bind that spirit of fear in the name of Jesus right now. God has not given us a spirit of fear. If God has not given us a spirit of fear, we have no right to hold on to fear. But He has given us power, love, and a sound mind. Let's just begin to say that. I believe the Lord is setting you free from fear right now. Just let's say it out. Father, I thank you. You've set me free from that spirit of fear. You've not given me a spirit of fear, but of power and of love. And a sound mind. I have a sound mind. A calm, relaxed mind. Thank you, Father. I don't have to be in trouble all my life. For you are the Prince of Peace. And you keep my mind in perfect peace. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord. We are free from fear. We are free, Lord. Thank you. You've given us a promise. We don't have to hold on to any spirit of fear of what has happened or what may happen. We have authority over fear in Jesus' name. Hallelujah. We worship you, Father, the Alpha Omega. Thank you, Lord.
You're the Alpha and Omega, the beginning and the end, the first and the last, Jesus Christ. You're the Alpha and Omega, the beginning and the end, the first and the last, Jesus Christ. We sing.
you're Jesus Christ. You've given us boldness to walk in this life. Bold as a light. Hallelujah, hallelujah. Hallelujah, restorer of all things. You are the way, the truth, and the life. Hallelujah. Before we listen to the word, we're going to sing this song. It talks about how in Proverbs 12, 28, in the way of righteousness there is life, and in the pathway there is no death. So we're going to sing that promise, and we're going to also declare who Jesus is to us, that he is the way, the truth, and the life. And we serve a God who is risen, who is alive, and who lives on the inside of us. And the line in, one of the lines in this song, it says um, that there is no stress or confusion when we're walking in the pathway of life. You don't have to be stressed out of life or what life has brought you because in the pathway of life, you can have peace of mind. You can be free from all stress and confusion. Hallelujah. I believe you can be free today from all of those confused thoughts or stressful thoughts because we serve a God who gives us perfect peace in our minds. That we can walk in this life knowing we have a sound mind. So we're going to declare that we're going to sing many promises in this song. And as you're singing it out, believe that you're free in your mind. You can be free today. Hallelujah. Let's sing this song. city 
promise again John 14 6 where it says Jesus you are the way the truth and the life we're gonna say it in a fun way so it's gonna be very easy you can see it after me and let's praise the Lord let's rejoice knowing that we serve a God who is leading us in the right way we're not serving a God who is dead but we're serving a God who is alive so let's sing those out and rejoice in him it goes like this oh Jesus Jesus you are the way Jesus Jesus Jesus, Jesus, you are the life. Jesus, Jesus, the way. Oh, Jesus, Jesus, you are the way. Jesus, Jesus, you are the truth. Jesus, Jesus, you are the life. Oh, Jesus, Jesus, the way. There is no death, nor destruction, no stress or confusion. Jesus is my perfect peace. In Jesus' name. 